all of us have in our veins the exact same percentage of salt in our blood that exists in the ocean. And therefore, uh, we have salt in our blood, in our sweat, in our tears. We are tied to the ocean. And when we go back to the sea, whether it is to sail or to watch it, we are going back from whence we came. Orcas are masters of the sea. Their only predators are human. In 1979, a young orca calf was captured off the coast of Iceland. He was kept in a holding facility and then sold to a sea aquarium in Canada. A few years later, he was sold again to a marine park in Mexico, where he performed for large crowds for nearly 11 years. Nowhere in recent history has a captive mammal garnered so much attention as Keiko, the orca star of the hit film Free Willy. The film's success partnered with growing public interest in animals held in captivity, launched the children's crusade that called for Keiko's release into the wild. The result, a multi-million dollar project that spanned four countries, weathered blistering controversy, and lasted nearly a decade. Through first-hand accounts by the marine mammal experts charged with his care, Keiko, the untold story, follows his life, his legacy of hope, and the untold story of his extraordinary years in Iceland and Norway. He left. But it was a very good lesson for Keiko. I think he learned a lot about ice that day. He just kept going. He kept going in a straight line, and he hit Norway. The ultimate highlight for me was watching and just being astounded by that accomplishment as he made his way across the Atlantic. So that was quite interesting to see that, that he finally was able to see his own species in his home waters. That was incredible by itself. <laughs>